and I'm on the Monogame team. Now, we're well aware that when you're using Monogame, when you first come to Monogame, it can be quite a steep learning curve, uh, even for a 2D game. So to simplify that for developers coming to Monogame, we're working on a start kit project template. Um, as you can see, uh, you'll be able to select it just like any. Uh, go to the next, type in your project name, um, and then hit create, and it will do that. Now, I've obviously created one earlier to appease the demo gods. And uh, once it loads, you'll see that the project template contains a or which has all the game logic and content. And then we have projects for Android, iOS, Desktop GL, which works on Mac, Linux, and uh, Windows. And of course, a more native Windows DirectX version. Uh, let's just have a look. Um, uh, and as you can see, they all reference the core. Yep. Which is where all, all of our centralized game logic, etc., is. So uh, let's just run up the desktop GL for now. Um, and you'll notice that this is based on the project sample that we originally had, which was a 2D Indiana Jones type game. Uh, but what uh, we've done is enhanced it by adding all the things that we think game developers need for a 2D game and to hit the ground running. Then you can take this solution and hack it for, for what you want. So uh, as you can see, we've got a menu system that you can access using keyboard or mouse uh, on desktops. On uh, mobile devices, you can use touch to select the menu items. Um, all that plumbing is already in there. And uh, then we've uh, added the ability to save certain things, states, for, like, for example, for settings, to show you how to do that. Uh, in this case, for example, if you wanted to change to a, from window to full screen, uh, languages, uh, as an example, uh, the ability to change languages dynamically. So, uh, for example, now everything's in Spanish. Uh, this sample comes with French, Spanish, and English by default, but you could, for example, have Russian. Um, and then we've also included a, a very simple particle system because most people who write a, a game will require some sort of particle, particle effects, particle effects. So there'll be some simple effects that you can test here. This will be the default effect used when you reach the end of a level, for example, just as an example. So let's go back and on, uh, we also have how you might want to do a tutorial. Obviously there are many ways to do a tutorial, but as a simple example uh, for this particular game, if I go to tutorial, it tells you you've got to collect these. This is all uh, multilingual as well. So it'll display in whatever language is currently active um, and something simple like that. Uh, we also opted, rather than going for a separate tutorial screen, to just have the ability, which I think is a more modern uh, a way of doing it, is to show the, the gamer what they need to do on the main screen itself. Obviously, you can hack it any way you want uh, and have a separate screen if you so desire. Uh, so... Uh, when yeah, when you hit play in this case, it shows a little bit of uh, player sc scripting, but in a very simple way, nothing fancy. It's uh, there's no script language as such. So uh, when you hit play, you'll see there's a brief thing it moves to the exit, and then we load the actual start of the first level. And here there are more enhancements uh, to the original sample. Uh, for example, there are breakaway tiles. Uh, there's the animation of collecting the, the gems. The gems now have different values. Uh, I'm not showing any um, enemies here, but 
Um, I'm still, we're still working on improve, making some levels that will show a nice progression uh, where it gets a little bit harder each, each level and you, you're trying to finish in the fastest time possible. Um, another enhancement to the original sample is that if you fall from a particular height, higher than you should, you will die. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this small tour of the uh, upcoming Monogame 2D Start Kit template. Um, leave comments below and let us know what you think and what you think maybe would be helpful in uh, when coming from other pools uh, to Monogame. Thanks. Bye for now.